Academy manager in seven years. There's a warning shot for you in football management, you know, if that's the job you're going into. What makes you, you know, you haven't got magic dust, what makes you the one that makes it different, you know, so, and some really big managers, big names. So I'm a realist as well, you know, I look at it and go, that's a challenge, because them seven haven't quite found the answer, and lots of money spent, lots of all the stuff that people think solve everything, not so much owners, but, you know, fans, oh, we've got money, so it's going to solve everything, it often doesn't. Um, it gives you a stronger hand, but it doesn't solve everything. So, yeah, that's why people were warning me, people in the game, just going, be careful with that one, that's a mess, you know, and it was... I don't think it was a mess in a way, it just lost its way, you know, I don't see it as a mess, it just, the club had lost its way and I think we're, we're trying to rebond that and take it back on a, on a better pathway. Can I ask then about, you get lost in moments, the moment that you found out or you were told about the 10 point deduction, that was during an international break, when you, for the, for the first few seconds, 30 seconds, minute, what were your immediate thoughts, because I know you said, just crack on with it, we can hit control, we control. Well, it, it, emotionally, it, you must have looked at it and gone. It could have been worse. I was in Dubai, and only a half a shandy, like, like you do. Did um, you I got a text message. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's fair to add it. Um, an interesting afternoon. Uh, no, I just got a text message saying, uh, from Kev Thel, saying, uh, he's sitting down, I need to call you. And I was like, right, okay. And he called me and said, right. So we immediately went, right, okay. Stop, stand still, as they say in coaching world, or they used to. Where is it at? Formula started immediately formulating some ideas, got on the staff and said, right, this is the way we're going to go with this. This is the direction. This is the immediate approach. And just went, right, that, that's where we're going with it. And, the, and we did, went to the players, spoke to them, got it straight out as quick as we could. Unfortunately, the news out, we couldn't do nothing about that. Um, but we got them on the WhatsApp, because it was an international break, we got them on the WhatsApp group, got them all involved and said, right, this is where it's at. As soon as we're back in, we'll make sure that we, we give ourselves sort of the base to work from. And we have. That moment, though, when you got that, call, well, got that text, got that call, whatever it was, it, did it feel like the rug had been pulled on, the rug had been pulled from underneath you? No, I don't think so. I mean, I, I think I think I don't have to say Dubai is just the last myself. Place you would probably well, no, think of getting I, something like that. I think it's fair to say. I think the whole of football was shocked, and I, I just think that's a fair thing. So I'm not crying it in remotely. Fans from all over were coming up to him. Dubai, going, what's that all about? You know, so. Let's have it right. I think, you know, that was a, like a you know, head scratcher for everyone. Just football fans, you know, from every other club were talking to me when I was away and when I got back. And of course, Evertonians are everywhere. So, yeah, everyone, everyone was um, um, very, very surprised, let's say the least, um, me included. I was going to ask you about Delhi. I was just wondering on him, though, um, where is he at? Because in December, he was training on his own. Then he's had surgery since then. Do you think... Everton fans will see him again this We'll season. see. He's, um, he's a long way to go. We've kept him deliberately, kept him back from it, and I agreed that with him just to give him time, give him space. So that's what we're doing. Hopefully he'll be back. We don't know. You've spoken in the canteen or to him that you've been saying that he often watches the sessions and kind of co like become a coach in this time that he's had. Well, like I say, we're, we're in the privacy that he needs, you know, at this time. He's in a good shape, a good state. Sorry, I spoke to him recently. I had a good, long conversation with him. And uh, making sense of another injury is difficult, but he'll come through that, I'm sure. He's OK, though. He, he was when I spoke to him, that was a couple of weeks ago. He was very informed and telling me what he thought.